In this video editing tutorial, I'm going to show you how to import media into Premiere Pro. To get started, if we launch Premiere Pro and go ahead and create a new project. Here I am going to go ahead and name this project and then select the location of where I want to save the project and then click on choose at the bottom right of this window when I have selected the location where I want the project to save at. Now, if you head over to the left hand side of the screen, there's a bunch of different folders from your computer that you can pull up all of your media from. Here, I am on my desktop folder where it will show available media that can be imported into Premiere. Now that I'm in my desktop folder, I'm going to go ahead and select the media that I want to import into my sequence. And then on the right hand side of the screen, you will have two new import options from the original ways. The first option is to create a new bin if you want to keep all of your footage self-contained in one folder. And then you also have another option of creating a new sequence based off of the order of clips that you select. In order to create a bin, if you go ahead to the right hand side of Premiere and toggle this on and drop this menu down and then add the name that you would like the folder to be called. Then go ahead and select create at the bottom of the window. This will then launch your project and in the project table on the left hand side you will see that the files that we selected have been imported into a separate bin. Now with our second option, you can add these clips straight onto a timeline. All we are going to do is untoggle the new bin option and toggle on create a new sequence. And then we are going to select the clips in the order that you want them to appear on the timeline. The first clip that you have selected here will be your first clip in your newly created timeline, as well as copy the clip settings over and use this as your sequence settings. There is also another way of importing media into Premiere Pro, which is more of a traditional way of importing media. If you untoggle this Create New Sequence option and make sure that you have no media selected, then if you go down here and select Create, this is going to open a new project. If you find your folder that has your media files in it that you are wanting to import, then all you have to do is just drag and drop the files into your project window, where it says Import Media to Start. That will then import all your media into your project. Another traditional method would be to double click the import media to start section, which will bring up a pop-up window for you to search for where your files are located, select the files, and then click import at the bottom right. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.